interesting and the best dream of my life that has actually come true. Once I had gone for a film shoot with my dad, as I had no idea where I am going, as it was a surprise for me. After some time, when I saw that I am at Flim City, I got a shock. I was so happy. I was so excited. So my father said, "Samia, how did you like the surprise?" I told my dad that dad, I cannot believe my eyes that I am here. So he said, "I knew you would be excited and happy." So now you sit here on the set. I'll just stop. And he went to meet the director and producer of the film. After some time, I saw a head peeping out from the vanity van of the makeup room. I said, "Let me go and see which hero shooting is on." Friends, when I went, I could not believe it. It was my superstar, the Shahrukh Khan. I was so excited on seeing him. I started searching for dad, and then I saw dad, and I ran to him, and I said, "That dad, dad." You know what? I just saw Shah Rukh Khan, and I want to meet him now. I'm so, so, so happy to see him. Please, I want to meet him now. So my dad said, "Okay, but right now the break is on. We we'll meet him after some time." I said, "No, what? No matter what, even if it's a break, I want to meet him." So somehow my dad said, "Okay, come, friends." When we were going towards the vanity van, my emotions, my excitement was building up so much. I was so happy. and finally we entered the room and i couldn't believe myself that i am seeing the sharukh khan right in front of me i was so 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 shocked speechless did not know what to say i said that this cannot be the reality please pinch me and he pinched me i said how shall i said no this is the reality the sharukh khan is right in front of me Then my dad introduced me to Shahrukh Khan and said that Shahrukh, he is my daughter Samia, and she is a very big fan of yours. So Shahrukh said, "Okay, Samia. So you now you need to tell me which is the favorite movie that you like of mine." I said, "My favorite movie is Dar." So he said, "Oh, your favorite movie is Dar. So from now for today, your name is not Samia. Your name is Sa 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 Samia." Oh my God! When he said that words, I could not stop my emotions and the excitement. I was so happy. I was like, I was not able to believe it even then. When he said these dialogues, it was really overwhelming. But I couldn't. I just, I just cannot. I mean, I cannot tell you all the feeling that was inside me. It was amazing. I was like really, really. Very happy. After some time, Dad said, "Samia, let's go as it's a break time and let Sharuk rest." I said, "Dad, can we be here for some time more?" So before my dad could say yes or no, Sharuk sir said, "We need you go leave your daughter here." So he said, "Okay," and went to meet the rest of the crew members. And I was with Sharuk sir in his vanity van. So we started talking about his movies. He started asking me which ones I have seen, any dialogues. So we were enjoying. So then I said to Shahrukh Khan that can I ask you a question? He said, Yeah, no issues. Go ahead. I said, As you know, we have come here for your interview. But before my dad takes your interview, can I take your interview from my side? He said, Sure. Go ahead. And then I started my questions. How did you enter the Bollywood? How is your journey in Bollywood been so far? Which film you think that has been the best for you? I took his interview. He really appreciated me with the confidence I had. He has say, he told me that he has never seen any youngster taking an interview in the way I have taken. So I was like so happy and I felt so nice with the gesture that he liked the way I took the interview. In that much time, till the time I was thanking him and he was appreciating me, my dad also came and said, "Samia, let's go. It's time to go." But I was still very glad that I got a chance to meet my superstar. Dear Sharu Khan, friends, if you see a dream and you are consistently trying to put an effort and achieve that dream, that yes, you want to do it, you will achieve it the way I have achieved it. Let me give you an example. When a person goes for an interview, you go for so many interviews and you keep trying the interview that I go for this interview, I go for that interview. And you keep trying, you do not get the job, and then when you get the job, the excitement that you get. So that is the thing. Consistency is the most important thing. Keep consistency so that you can achieve whatever you uh, dream you have seen or whatever goals you want to achieve will only come if you put an effort. So friends, the moral of the story is: 
if you want to fulfill any dream in your life be consistent put an effort till the time you don't achieve it okay friends so bye